What if I told you your PC is quietly killing your CS2 performance and a few hidden tweaks could unlock smoother gameplay, higher FPS and zero stutters? In this video, I'll show you exactly how to force Windows to prioritize CS2, fix random lag spikes and boost FPS like the pros. Stick around because by the end, your game won't just run better, it'll feel next level. Let's get started. The Gear Up Booster application is a powerful tool designed to help you achieve zero ping and maximum FPS. Download the application for free using the provided link in description. Select the CS2 game and click the Boost button. This will initiate the network optimization process, selecting the best routing settings for you automatically. Download it now. First, open your control panel and head over to Security and Maintenance. Once you're there, Click on the Maintenance section to expand it. This section controls how Windows handles background tasks, many of which can silently impact your CS2 performance if not managed properly. Next, click on Change Maintenance Settings. In this window, you'll find an option that says Allow scheduled maintenance to wake up my computer at the scheduled time. Make sure to uncheck this box. If left enabled, your system might wake up on its own, even while you're playing CS2, just to run updates or perform scans in the background. These interruptions can cause sudden lag spikes, FPS drops, or background CPU usage without warning. Just below that, you'll see a setting to choose the scheduled maintenance time. Set this to an hour when you're never gaming. 3 o'clock AM is generally a safe pick. This helps ensure Windows performs its maintenance during your inactive hours, keeping all available system resources focused on delivering the highest possible FPS and eliminating random lag during your CS2 matches. Now, launch Counter-Strike 2 and wait until you're fully loaded into the main menu or in-game. Once it's running, right-click on your taskbar and open Task Manager. Now, go to the Details tab this section displays all the active processes running on your system, including CS2. Scroll through the list and find CS2.exe. Once you spot it, right-click on it and first select Set Affinity. A new window will appear showing all your CPU cores. By default, all cores are selected, which means CS2 is using every available thread. But if you're on a low, or mid-range CPU, tweaking this can give you a nice performance boost. You can uncheck one or two of the less powerful or virtual cores to leave room for background apps like Discord or OBS, ensuring they don't interrupt your gameplay. Alternatively, if you want to push CS2's performance fully, prioritize the strongest physical cores only, avoiding weaker threads. This reduces stutters and keeps your CPU focused on the game. Now, while still in the Details tab, right-click on CS2.exe again, and this time select Set Priority, then choose High. This tells Windows to treat CS2 as a top priority task, giving it more CPU time over background apps or system processes. It's a simple but powerful tweak that many overlook, and it can make a noticeable difference in FPS stability and responsiveness, especially during action-heavy matches. Keep in mind, both the affinity and priority settings reset after a restart. So, if you want to keep using this method, you'll need to repeat these quick steps every time you launch the game. But the performance improvement makes it totally worth it. The Gear Up Booster application is a powerful tool designed to help you achieve zero ping and maximum FPS. Download the application for free using the provided link in description. Select the CS2 game and click the Boost button. This will initiate the network optimization process, selecting the best routing settings for you automatically. Download it now. Now, press Windows plus R on your keyboard. Type Regedit and hit enter to open the registry editor. Once the editor is open, navigate to the following path. Don't worry, you can copy this exact path from the video description to make things easier. When you reach the correct location, 
Look for the entry named Start on the right side. Double click on it and in the box that appears, change the value data from 2, which means it's currently enabled, to 4, which disables it. Then click OK to save the change. After that, close the registry editor and restart your system. This tweak disables the NDU, Network Data Usage Monitoring, service. By turning it off, you're preventing Windows from constantly tracking network usage in the background, something that can quietly eat up resources. Disabling it helps lower network-related latency, reduces unexpected FPS drops during CS2 multiplayer matches, and gives you a smoother, more stable gaming experience especially in high action rounds or ranked games. Now, click on the Windows search bar, type Advanced System Settings, and open the option that says View Advanced System Settings. In the System Properties window, locate the Performance section and click on the Settings button. This will open a new window titled Performance Options. Now, switch over to the Advanced tab and under the Virtual Memory section, click on Change. By default, Windows manages your paging file size automatically. But this isn't always optimal for gaming performance, especially in demanding games like CS2. To take full control, first uncheck the box that says Automatically manage paging file size for all drives. Then select your main system drive, usually labeled as Local Disk. C and choose the custom size option. For the initial size, enter a value of 1361. For the maximum size, use this simple formula. Multiply your total RAM in GB by 1024, then divide the result by two. For example, if you have 16 GB of RAM, multiply 16 cut 1024 on 16384, then divide by 2 to get 81092 MBE. Enter this number into the maximum size field. Once both values are set, click Set, then OK, and finally restart your PC to apply the changes. This adjustment allows your system to handle large CS2 files and background tasks much more efficiently, helping to reduce stutters, prevent memory bottlenecks, and ensure smoother gameplay especially during intense matches or when multitasking during a gaming session. Now, press the Windows key, type Task Scheduler and open it. This tool controls all the scheduled background tasks that Windows runs automatically, even during gaming sessions. Once it's open, carefully browse through the Task Scheduler library and look for tasks related to Windows Defender scans, Windows Update triggers, or system maintenance routines. These types of tasks are often set to activate quietly in the background, which can cause sudden CPU spikes, disk usage, and lag during gameplay. Go through each of these scheduled tasks one by one. For any that aren't critical to system stability, especially those tied to routine scans or update checks, right-click on the task and select Disable. Be cautious and avoid disabling any tasks that are essential for Windows security or hardware compatibility. By disabling these background processes, you make sure your system won't start unnecessary jobs while you're mid-match in CS2. This tweak helps eliminate random stutters and input delays caused by background interruptions, giving you a more stable and consistent FPS throughout your gameplay. It's a pro-level optimization that many overlook. But once applied, it significantly improves your system's focus on gaming performance. That's it guys. Try these tweaks and watch your CS2 run smoother than ever. If it helped, drop a like, subscribe, and turn on the bell so you don't miss the next guide. Got questions? Comment below. I'll help you out. Thanks for watching.